father. Now, my colleague John Burkett, he has exclusive sources and has new details tonight about how the victim and the suspect may be connected. John, what are you learning? Well, on the minds of many, Maggie, is why did this happen and what was the motive? Tonight, my sources helped me connect the dots between the 19-year-old suspect and 18-year-old Huguenot graduate Sean Jackson. Richmond police released this information about suspected shooter Amari Pollard Wednesday. He is a resident of Henrico County. He was arraigned this morning uh, in Richmond General District Court on two counts of second-degree murder. He is being held without bond. Police believe Pollard and Huguenot graduate Sean Jackson did know each other. Crime Insider sources tell me detectives are investigating how long they've known each other, but are confident it's been a couple of years. Those same sources telling me detectives have honed in on two theories. Words exchanged between the two at Tuesday's graduation ceremony at the Altria Theater or the 2021 killing of Thomas Jefferson student Davion Elliott. Elliot and the suspect Pollard were friends. Social media posts and music videos show Jackson, an aspiring rapper, with lyrics referring to a chess shot. That's how Elliot was killed on Larry Moore Road in South Richmond. Elliot's death ruled a justified homicide, and multiple sources confirm Jackson was part of that police investigation. I spoke to Davion's mom by phone, who tells me, I would not wish death or grief on anyone. Losing a child is losing a piece of your heart. If rumors are true that this was done out of retaliation for my son, I would ask these kids or people who called my son their friend to stop and end this now. Nothing good will come from it. I'm hurt my son's case is closed, but I'm going to let God handle it. Police continue working every angle of this case through asking for people that may have videos inside the Altria Theater during graduation or outside the Altria uh, Theater after the graduation to please send that video into RPD. Reporting live outside of Huguenot High School in Richmond tonight, John Burkett, CBS 6 News. Thank you, John. Today, Richmond Public School Superintendent Jay.